Hey, what's good, everybody? I'm Jigs, and I'm going to show you how to make the most powerful and most beefy spear in Smash Ultimate. You can apply this spear to any character and be confident that you will deal around five times the damage you would deal without using the spirit with any attack. The first thing I will go over is how to obtain the spirit in the first place, then how to modify the spirit to make them as strong as possible. We will be using the spirit board to obtain this spirit, so we will need to use a few support items to get the specific spirit. First off, get as many rematch support items as you think would be necessary. I would recommend having around 10 or more if you aren't confident that you could beat a legendary spirit within just a few times. Next, you want to find a bunch of shuffle all or shuffle all primaries as you can get, so you can speed up the process for finding the spirit. Both the rematch spirit and the shuffle spirits can periodically be found in the shop, so when you find them, buy a ton of them. Next, keep shuffling until you find the spirit named Akuma. This spirit is the absolute strongest spirit you could possibly get in the entire game. The game developers tried to balance his intense power by removing all three support slots from him, but he is still extremely strong without supports. He is also a legendary class spirit, which also defines why Akuma is so strong. Now, once you find him on the spirit board, you will fight in a stamina battle against Ryu on an Omega stage. Make sure you have your strongest spirit active for the battle, if you don't want to attempt to cheese him. One cheesy method I found to work somewhat consistently is hanging on the ledge with Kirby, ledge dropping, double jumping, then sucking in Ryu for as long as possible. Some of the time he will make it back and you will probably lose the game, but if that doesn't work, you can also try King Dedede since he falls faster and can bring Ryu down lower. Now that you have Akuma, you want to level him up to level 99 so he can be maxed out. But there is still one more crucial step to making Akuma as strong as possible. If you don't know, Adventure Mode has many different dojos you can train your spirits in, which buff certain stats and nerf opposing stats. You can find these dojos hidden all around World of Light, but there is one dojo specifically that we want to use to make our spirit as strong as possible. The dojo we need to train Akuma in is Ryoma's dojo, which replaces defense for offense. The dojo style is called Demon Style. Ryuma can be found here, at the upper right part in World of Light. To get here, you need to remove the wall of light to access the right part of the map, which requires you to push all three of the buttons located as shown. After you push the three buttons, you need to go through the portal, defeat the spirits until you find Pit, and then finally defeat Pit to remove the wall of light. After you remove the wall of light, you want to go through the retro section until you end up near the ocean, then go right. Keep defeating spirits until you end up right here. You will find a spirit called Lapras, so defeat them and you will have access to a new island, so go there and battle spirits until you end up in this location. You will need to fight the Alfonso and Engineer Link spirit, and this will give you access to riding trains. After obtaining that spirit, go back here from the retro area and fight spirits along this path. Ride on the train using the Engineer spirit and travel along this new path, fighting spirits along the way. Now, just fight a few more spirits and there you go, Ryuma's Dojo. Train Akuma in here, and speed it up if you want to, and now you have the strongest spirit in the game. Save the spirit in a team, and now you can use it versus your friends offline and in online arenas. Apply this spirit to any character, and they will be five times as powerful as they were without the spirit. Thank you all for watching, and have fun absolutely destroying your enemies!